With me, it's always a few coffees later. So here we had one at uh, Lipstick at Sosopol. was a nice experience. It's a, it's a great place. I enjoyed it. We stayed at what I thought was an abandoned hotel. Well, it wasn't. There were apartments in there. We met Jürgen and Marcus. Many good talks with uh, Marcus. Great laugh with uh, Jürgen. And you're going to see him in a second. The day for me is not okay without a good cappuccino. Mm, and I got one. Lavanza. <laughs> and with a coffee or cappuccino, this is what you get in Bulgaria. I guess it's like a fortune cookie without the fortune. Or rather, a fortune cookie without the cookie. Inside you have uh, that, <laughs> that thing. And in my case, it says traveling. Well, not astonishing. That's what I'm doing indeed. The past three days have been quite spectacular, I can tell you that. So we found a home base. And here we are in uh, the middle of, not, not really nowhere, we are in the middle of um, a quite unspoiled beach. Uh, behind us is a natural reserve, charging, recharging our batteries in the proper sense of the word. The one of uh, EcoFlow, which is marvelous, and recharging our own batteries because um, buying a duplex apartment, first row, uh, is emotionally challenging, I can tell you that. This beach is unspoiled, the other side not. That's a five star hotel. On that side, and rather beautiful, uh, there are are some houses, rather big ones, uh, in the Bulgarian style, which is nice. Lots of birds around here, not so many people, quite nice.